Season's greetings. Uh, first of all, thank you for stepping up and doing more than your part to keep one another safe by wearing masks, social distancing, and observing our local public health orders this holiday season. As your governor and commander in chief, I wanna express my appreciation for everything that you do. I know that it takes a strong support system to ensure that you can serve. So thank you to all of your family members and support network and people that are standing with our servicemen and women, giving them the encouragement they need. To our Gold Star families whose loved ones have made the ultimate sacrifice in service to our state and nation, we honor you and we remember our fallen heroes. To the men and women of the Department of Military and Veterans Affairs who answered the call during our state's historic COVID-19 and wildfire responses, as well as search and rescue in the high country and election security, you've shown you're always ready and there to assist our communities. To our National Guard members working 24 seven to defend Colorado and our nation from air, space and missile based threats, thank you. To our National Guard members deployed around the world, you're in our thoughts and prayers as you safeguard our national security and defend our friends. I look forward to your safe return. To our Division of Veterans Affairs, thanks for finding innovative ways to connect our military members, veterans, and their families to benefits they deserve to the Civil Air Patrol. Your delivery of PPE throughout the state has made a big difference in saving lives. On behalf of the grateful state of Colorado, I wish for the entire DMVA family that your future is bright with blessings and your spirit is filled with holiday cheer. Merry Christmas and happy holidays.